All right, guys, we spent like an hour resting, and now we're about to go for some food and to check out whatever this little island has to offer. Uh, I'm feeling so beat though. I mean, it's amazing how doing nothing for so long can make you feel so tired. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's so weird. But yeah, anyways, head out now and uh, let's see what we find. Yeah, guys, just rented some bicycles and we're about to head off to check out some of the waterfalls around this place. Maybe if we're lucky, we'll even see the dolphins. Guess we'll find out. Yeah, do this one. And it's red, if that ain't something. Yep. It is also horrible to drive. <laughs> Quite comfy. The chain just jumped off for the fourth time. This bike sucks. God damn it, this is annoying. Well, let's see how many times this is gonna happen today. Oh, and then in this heat. Oh. oh well. That's what you get, I guess, when you rent a bike for 10,000 kip. Like two euros. <laughs> oh well, I have to fix this. Be right back. Did it again. That makes for five. <sighs> that was seven times till now the chain jumped. Anyways, we're just crossing over the bridge now to one of the bigger islands where um, all the waterfalls are. And uh, yeah, check the view. It's a pretty cool little place, I'd say. It's very hot today. I got oil everywhere now. <laughs> and that's number 10. <laughs> Maybe I should get out of the way. It's not a kid. Yeah, no. That's the big one. <laughs> if they have a kid. That yeah, means no, they're gonna kill you. <laughs> okay, that's a little extreme, maybe, but it happens, mate. It happened to. Of or course, not, it has happened. A guy I knew. A guy I knew got killed by a buffalo. Someone who died because he got uh, knocked into by a cow. Yeah, I know. Yeah, because it was fun. Cows kill more people than uh, yeah, sharks does every year. Yeah, yeah then shit happens, I guess. He thought he was threatening the.
so I think that's pretty much the end of these little uh, waterfalls or rapids, uh, whatever you call them. Uh, there's supposed to be a little beach area uh, just further down uh, below one of the cliffs. So we're gonna go check it out, just because why not? I mean, we're here anyways. <laughs> I gotta say that the landscape here is very, very interesting because, I mean, look at it. It's not something I've seen anywhere else. Um, and I'd imagine long, long ago, like, the whole thing was probably covered in water and then slowly it's just been digging these uh, little cliffs in between the rocks. That's my guess, anyways. And yeah, I think this is super cool. Anyways, still trying to find that little beach area. Let's move on. Hmm. It's actually like a proper beach. Made it this far. Not a bad place. I gotta say though, judging by the current, this is not the best place to go for a swim. <laughs> At least I'd call it risky. So, there's two missions right now. First of all, don't fall, because that would hurt. And after that, we hit it up here. I'll show you. See, there's these little bamboo huts. Gonna go up, get a drink, and stay in the shade for a bit. Because, let me be the first to tell you, it's very, very hot outside today. Which is amazing, not complaining. But, some shade and a cold drink sounds like the best course of action to take right now. Yeah. See if we can find our way up there. We've been here for around 45 minutes now, I believe, and we're gonna start to head back to the bikes now, and um, we're gonna check out this other little waterfall on, uh, on the other side of the island. Um, no idea how long it's gonna take to get there, but hopefully, <laughs> hopefully the bike won't <laughs> completely break down. Anyways, we're gonna get going.
a little dog and a chicken. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right, so here we are in the absolute middle of nowhere and Tony's bike just completely broke the back tire. <laughs> um, so yeah, we have to pull our bikes right now and it probably happened in the worst place it possibly could have because we are literally in the middle of nowhere, as you can see. Uh, hopefully on our way back, we should pass a place where we can actually, actually get this thing fixed. Anyways, we're very close to the last stop of the day anyways, um, which is this waterfall just around here. I can actually hear it now, so it must be just behind these bushes. Oh, maybe not, but we are getting closer. Yeah, I'll see you in a bit. I'm being eaten by mosquitoes now, the sun is starting to set. Anyways, that should be it for today. Um, gotta somehow make our way back now with the broken bikes. Uh, but yeah, no more chasing waterfalls for today. That's basically what I'm saying. Also, the sun is gonna set soon, so you can probably see behind me. So, uh, we better start getting home before it gets, yeah, completely black out here, because the street lights is not really a thing, obviously. Oh, there's something on the lens. I got you guys. Did that help? Did you feel it? <laughs> All right. Whoa, shit, look. Sorry, look at these guys. Right, so we did actually find a place to get the bikes fixed now. And hopefully we'll be on our way back soon. <laughs> These lovely people here are helping us out. That's the best part about Asia. There's literally bike repairs anywhere. <laughs> Even when you're in the middle of nowhere. And bam, that's it. Just 10 minutes later and the bikes are fixed. No sign of Tony anywhere though. No clue where he went. <laughs> but yeah, that was just 10,000 kips, so super cheap as one. Now we headed back. All right, guys, that is it. I am back in my little pink bungalow room. <laughs> um, just had a shower. Super nice. Very cold, but super nice. Uh, now we're gonna head out for some dinner, a couple of drinks, and I guess call it like somewhat of an early night. So thank you guys very much for watching. Um, I hope you will follow me again tomorrow on a new adventure. And don't forget, if you like what you see, hit the subscribe button and leave it a thumbs up. Press the like, alright? Thank you again, guys. I'll see you tomorrow.